Hey, what's going on? This is Jeremy with Live Bearded, and we've been helping beardsmen look, feel, and be their best since 2016. And with over 50,000 five-star reviews, I know we can help you too. The goatee is a facial hairstyle that has earned its place as an iconic beard shape over the years. Its history dates back centuries, with depictions of similar styles found in ancient art and sculptures. However, the modern goatee as we know it gained widespread popularity in the 20th century. The name goatee is derived from the cluster of hair on a goat's chin, as the style resembles a small pointed beard in the center of the chin. This beard style has become iconic due to its ability to exude both ruggedness and sophistication simultaneously. It has been associated with various cultural icons, from musicians and actors to intellectuals and philosophers. The goatee is often seen as a symbol of individuality and rebellion, making it a favorite amongst men seeking to make a bold yet anonymous statement with their facial hair. While the goatee can suit various face shapes, it tends to look the best on individuals with more angular and well-defined jawlines. Men with round or square faces can also pull off the goatee by adding some grooming finesse to balance their features. The key is to maintain a sense of proportion and symmetry, ensuring that the goatee complements the natural contours of the face. Numerous famous personalities have embraced the goatee throughout history. Some notable examples include Robert Downey Jr., Johnny Depp, Adam Driver, Brad Pitt, and the legendary heavy metal frontman, James Hetfield. Their adoption of the goatee has further fueled its iconic status and inspired countless men to try the style out for themselves. To achieve a goatee from scratch, grow out your facial hair for a few days until a sufficient amount of stubble appears. Then, using a sharp razor or the MT1 beard trimmer, the stubble should be shaped into a small, well-defined patch on the chin, typically covering the area from the bottom of the lip or the sole patch to the tip of the chin. The rest of the facial hair, including the mustache, should be removed, leaving only the goatee intact. For those transitioning from a full beard to a goatee, it's best to start by trimming the beard down to the desired goatee length, then gradually reducing the size of the beard until only the central chin portion remains. This allows the individual to get accustomed to the new look before going the full Monty. Maintaining a goatee requires regular grooming to keep it looking neat and sharp. Trimming every few days or weekly, depending on the rate of facial hair growth, is necessary to maintain the shape and prevent the goatee from appearing unkempt. Beard oil and beard butter can be applied to keep the skin hydrated and the facial hair soft and moisturized. The goatee offers various stylistic variations for those looking to personalize their look. Some popular goatee variations include the Van Dyke, which combines a disconnected mustache and chin beard. The goat patch, which extends the width of the sole patch to the tip of the chin. And the full goatee, which combines and connects the mustache to the classic goatee. You can experiment with different shapes, lengths, and sizes to find out which goatee style suits your personality and appearance the best. Remember, using Live Bearded's all-natural products to keep your beard and skin hydrated, conditioned, and clean will truly make all the difference in how you look and feel. I hope this helps you on your beard journey. Please reach out to us anytime at supportlivebearded.com if you have any questions. And as always, Live Bearded. I like it. And legendary heaven med- eh. Of ruggedness, too much personality. That, that, I actually read that right. The clicker's not working. God damn it. While the go key can suit well, go. <laughs> the go key. Rod, you low class mongrel. I'm a robot.